Health authorities say it's no longer a matter of if, but when the Omicron variant will enter the Philippines. If so, just how ready is the country once the new variant enters our shores? That big question and more with Testing Chief and Health Undersecretary Leopold de Vega, Yusek Vega. Welcome po ulit sa big story. Good evening, Robbie, and good evening to all the listeners and uh, good evening to Marisa. Mm. Yusek, maybe let's start with the 250 travelers from South Africa. Pagkatapos, there's a number there that's undergoing verification. What do all of these numbers mean? It only means that uh, we really have to intensify and take some necessary precautions on our border control. And it means that uh, people coming from uh, these red list countries, uh, most specifically South Africa, they had to be uh, screened and tested and should have a biosurveillance or genotyping for the possibility of uh, the Omicron uh, COVID-19. Mm. Kanina po, may nabanggit lang si Yusek Verhere. Is there still a question on the transmissibility of this variant? Yeah, uh, there have been reports that because of this mutation of the 30 uh, places in the spike protein, uh, they have been saying that uh, the virus or this uh, Omicron is uh, much more uh, transmissible compared to the alpha, beta, and the delta variant. Now, uh, this has been uh, not been proven, and uh, we are still awaiting the recommendation of the Department of, of, of the WHO in terms of the peer group analysis of the, uh, of the research that has been done that is uh, to say that uh, they are really very transmissible. But we have to take the necessary precautions because of the mutations that they have much more than the uh, Delta variant. Uh, kanina po, nabanggit din ni Yusek Verhere that it is inevitable. We might as well assume it's inevitable. It's a matter of when, uh, not if. And she says that we're not trying to prevent, we're just buying time. And while we're buying time, we are preparing. So to that end, ano po ang nagbago? What have we changed? And how are we preparing? Is it a matter of actual changes or is it just a matter of more? Actually, uh, you know, the, the uh, Omicron uh, variant is definitely would uh, come to our shores once this day because uh, of the uh, uh, global trouble that uh, we have. Now, the uh, only thing is uh, that we need to take the necessary uh, precautions and restrictions, especially with our border, starting off with uh, screening them with RT-PCR and, of course, biosurveillance and making sure that... Uh, the, uh, past the isolation and quarantine uh, 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 places for this uh, patient would be with the uh, community at the community level would be very appropriate when once they come around. Okay, Yusek Vega, maraming salamat po. That was uh, Undersecretary Leopoldo Vega of the Department of Health.